Okay, good afternoon, YouTube. Hi, it's your girl Charlotte here. I am going to talk to you briefly while I am driving um, about being positive and staying positive about what you feel is important in your life, especially if you um, are doing your own business and you feel like you just don't get that support like you should. Well, everybody's not going to be in favor of your of your success. So let's get that down for number one. Everyone is not going to understand what you're doing, believe in what you're doing, and care what you're doing. The number one person that has to be the cheerleader is you. Let me stop this from moving around. Okay, there we go. So you have to be your number one cheerleader. You have to believe in your business when nobody else do. And sometimes it can be hard. sometimes it can be a challenge um, because after a while you start thinking to yourself okay well hmm, if this person don't think it's good and this person don't think it's good but even though if you don't change your mindset and grab a hold of your mind and tell yourself the reasons why you're in business for yourself why you started your business and um, why you believe it's going to work, you will be like those people. You will start thinking like them. And then for you to know it, all that you've worked so hard for is down the drain. Because you start thinking just like the naysayers. There are many, many, Nay, many more naysayers out here than a little bit and you have to face that fact and then the other thing is you just gotta believe what you're doing is worth it if you believe it and you see the positive side and you see that it's something that generally can generate revenue for you and your family and you can eat up, oh, girl. You put a deaf ear to the naysayers because they will always think, um, well, I'm going to let this person, I'm going to see how far they get before I even think about it. Well, you know what? You could be wasting time, um, wasting, you know, time on people like that. And it's just not worth it in today's time. In today's society, in 2019, almost, you know, within what, six, seven months would be in 2020, you have to have more than one revenue of income. You have to. Because uh, one income is just not going to cut it. It's not cutting it right now. And as we get into 1920, 1922, 19, you know, 25, 26, as we get more and more years, if, if the Lord allow us to be blessed to see these years to come, um, the prices of things is going to be different. We're not going to be de dealing much less with dollars. Um, everything's going to be probably on a card. So if you're in that stream of business or if you know anything about changing over, um, you need to pay attention. Pay attention to what's going on. People are out here talking and people are out here giving bits and pieces of information that people need to listen to to be more successful um, in the years to come. So, if you are, 
like I said, serious about what you do, you see the, um, the generating of revenue and income from that, do not listen to naysayers. Hold on to what you believe in and keep striving and doing what you do. Because there are people who are just going to be negative because they're negative and have been negative all their life. And they're going to be that way. Okay? So, just shoot those people to the side and keep yourself around the people who are doing what you want to do. Who are going places, who are successful. Keep yourself around. I can say, I know a millionaire. Those millionaires. And do that. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later.